name is Joanne Spraga. I am proud to be the executive director of the Children's Museum of Greater Fall River. Well, the Children's Museum is an interactive museum. The primary age is 2 to 10 with some overlap. We call tweens. We do some work with middle school, and there are some exhibits that even babies could, you know, participate in. It's very interactive. Uh, explore, discover, grow is our, in our tagline. And we also say that it's a place where children come to play and learn, and adults learn to play again. Uh, children's museums are based on volunteerism. Uh, it's part of our mission uh, to involve the community uh, in our museum. So we, uh, volunteers play an intricate part of the Children's Museum in many ways, from building exhibits uh, to hands-on daily uh, interaction with children and behind-the-scenes work. We've had a number of volunteer BCC students. Even before we had our building, we had BCC students helping us with our museum without walls. Uh, when we took over uh, this magnificent building in, in uh, January 2012, first people to volunteer were BCC students when we asked them to come help us build Violet's Room. And uh, Professor Marissa Millard gathered students together and uh, they did a magnificent job of the murals in Violet's room and then Professor Eric Durant uh, came along when we were ready for the dinosaur room and designed a course called Museum Fabrication and uh, Eric and his students have built a, just a tremendous room uh, in the dinosaur room. Uh, Professor Kathleen Hancock has been hands-on and some of her students have helped as well as well as the early childhood students. Uh, under the direction of Melissa Cardelli, who was our board president, um, have been, done a lot of the hands-on and we will actually have 10 students this fall doing service learning through early childhood.